Julia Tawa from jmwaspeaks.com and today I will be interviewing the hottest and latest gospel sensation, Daniel Morrison. So stay tuned for a fun and energetic interview with a name you don't want to forget, Daniel Morrison. Ladies and gentlemen, let us welcome Daniel Morrison to the hot seat. <laughs> Welcome, how are you? I'm, I'm well. You looking well, nice and so. spiffy. Hey, say so you look oh, nice yeah. and spiffy. Oh, yeah. I like the bow tie and everything. It's, you know, but question, is it a clip on or did you tie it yourself? Well, it's it's, it's a new tech. It's, uh -huh. uh, it's a clip. Uh -huh. It's a tie, so uh -huh. I'll call it a clip bow tie. <laughs> okay, so our first question is, we just want to get to know you. So just tell us about yourself and let the viewers know who you are. Well, so thank you so much. Uh, like you said, my name is um, Danny Morrison. Um, funny thing is, I did not even start off as a gospel artist. Really? I was a rapper. Uh, I was wow. a very skinny dude. <laughs> Back in the day, I remember I had a, uh, had a high top hair. Wow. We put a little spin on top. We call it funky bread oh, my at that goodness. time. We need a picture of that. Yeah, I think yeah. we all Well, I mean, we all kept in the archives anyway. <laughs> so, um, this journey started uh, a friend of mine. Uh, you know, he invited me to his church mm -hmm. and the word was going on mm -hmm. after the service. Mm -hmm. uh, and how old were you at that time? I think I was 17. 17, okay. Yeah, 17, 18 ish. Okay. And uh, he, the word was preached, they made wow. an altar call. Now, the funny thing about the altar call is at that time, mm -hmm. I had a very excruciating pain on my chest. Wow. Right there. And I went to the altar call. Mm -hmm. The pastor prayed for me. I gave my life to Christ. And he said, if you have any pain, put your hand on it. He will pray and the pain will just go away. I put my hand on my chest. He prayed instantly. Wow. That was my first miracle. Wow. Now, for someone who hasn't sung before, who is always a rapper, mm. the whole thing mm. started after that. Wow. Yeah. That's awesome. It is. It so, long so after that experience and after that miracle, is right. that when you felt like you wanted to give your life to Christ and start gospel? Or? Well, I gave my life to Christ after that, you know, and uh, you know, like you go through like it's like a transition. Mm -hmm. Everything doesn't happen, you know. Overnight. Right. So gradually, then we started a group uh, for a quartet, a gospel group. Okay. I started okay. singing. Um, by then <laughs> you we left we, the rapping behind. Yeah, we, we left the rapping. Oh, but I have another rap in me. Oh, well, I mean, I we're gonna get into that later yeah. on in the show. But um. <laughs> Well, we, we did some gospel rap, mm -hmm. then we formed a group, a, a singing group, we call ourselves For Heaven. For Heaven. Um, we were singing in Lighthouse, we sang in the third service, wow. we sang in I think third and fourth service. Um, and where was this? This was here or was this? No, this was uh, way back at Polygon, Ghana. Wow, okay, got yeah. And uh, you know, that was, that was how it all began, mm -hmm. you know, and uh, I think everybody uh, found their way and uh, we all kind of split it and I found myself. Wow, yeah. that is awesome. It what is. a journey. It is. I mean, from rap artist <laughs> to being, you know, in a group to, you it's, know, now being a solo uh, artist is a real, it's, it's a musical but journey. Tell you, God is good. Amen. He is. Amen. But I have a question. So what made you not want to do gospel rap? Well, I have a little gospel rap in Oh, here. okay. In my album. Oh, okay, great. Yeah. You want to have a taste of that? Yes, please do. Can we get a little something? You Are want you ready? Do you want me to drop a oh, beat? No, oh, no, no, no. Okay. <laughs> Okay now, so listen to this. All right. Check it. I want to share a lake with talk with you. Hey. Fellas, about a man who lived some years ago. They call him Jesus, Messiah, ha. son of a living God, the king of kings, hey. the Lord of lords, who died on the cross for me and you. Wash away our sins so you may be and you become a you turn pure as a fallen snow. So my homies, my poses, and my brethren, change your freak. The key ways that hey. you're living in. Are you in drinks? Are you weighing down with the X thing? Come on. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Hey! <laughs> Listen, if you want to get the rest of that, you got to get the album. This is just to. a snippet. This is <laughs> what? That is so cool. Wow, wow. Trust me, there's many more of that. You have to get the album. I'm so excited for this album you, you now. This is be, awesome. So. He is a multi talented artist here. All right? <laughs> this is what we I have. I wouldn't call myself that, but hey, I'll take the call. <laughs> So speaking of the album, please right. let us know the name, and I, I want to know, or we would like to know, what was the inspiration behind the album, um, and when is the album actually coming out? Well, let me start by saying the inspiration behind 
the single is okay. out now. The single is called Udin, Udin yes. uh, which means your name. Mm -hmm. uh, the Bible says, at the mention of the name of Jesus, every knee shall bow and every tongue shall confess that Jesus Christ is Lord. Mm -hmm. Now that is one scripture that talks about the name of Jesus. But this became more real to me and I have a story to it. Now, the story is, uh, well, so way back I have a pastor friend. Mm -hmm. He wanted to start a church. Mm -hmm. So, um, he had fasted for 40 days. Wow. And after the 40 days, uh, well, during that 40 days, every Friday we have an all night service. Mm -hmm. So, the prayer that he was praying within that 40 days, and I remember very well, he prayed for a couple who was looking for a child, <coughs> and they were, they, the lady conceived twins. We knew what? it was that prayer. Wow. Praise God. Well, but, yeah, that's just one aspect of the story. But so, in his prayer, when he was in, in, in the prayer and the delivery, he keeps saying, Nidin, Wudin, the Jesus. So he kept mentioning and repeating that name throughout the prayer. That thing really hit me. And after that prayer session, I started, you know, it started ringing in my mind, it started ringing in my spirit about the name of Jesus. The name is a package. The name brings salvation. The name brings healing. The name breaks down every yoke of the enemy. The name makes a way for you. So that was the name, and the name became the song for the internet. Wow, there you have it. There you have it. Wow, Amen. wow, amen. That's so powerful. Amen. Well, but about the album too, it's a 10 track album. 10 track, wow. Yeah, and... Uh, and like, how long did it take you to record? Um, I have written most of the songs over the years, but for the whole song, but for the whole album, it took me two weeks in the studio to record it. Two weeks? Two weeks. Like, You're kidding. Like, two weeks. <laughs> Did you like sleep in the studio? And <laughs> exactly what happened. I was in the studio 24 7 because wow. I had a very short time, you know? Yeah. Um, studios are no cheap these exactly. days, you know, so you have exactly. to pay all this money. Exactly. You don't want it. So you have to prepare very well wow. before you I mean, record it. And um, compliment to Groove House Studio. Shout compliment to, to uh, Jose Francis, one of the best producers ever. Wow. After one. It's amazing. Um, we have to work over time and get this album ready. Wow, that's awesome. That's amazing. That is really amazing. So this is the album cover here, right? Yes, that's it. This is what we it. can expect. Wow, this is awesome. This looks great. Well, thank you. But um, I want to give compliments for this branding to a very good friend of mine. Uh, his name is uh, Jesse Mante. He was wow. gracious enough to Shout out design to uh, this uh, album cover, and you know what? He shot my music video as really? well. Really? Yeah. Wow! Oh, Jesse is just jack of all trades. He, is, <laughs> he, he does is. it all. He is a so, multi-talented person. So, speaking of the album, what was actually the inspiration behind the album, and what can people expect from this new album? Well, this the album has um, worship songs. Mm -hmm. uh, well. Now we call five song praise songs. We right. have, like I said, we have some rap. Mm -hmm. We have some reggae on the songs. Wow. As well. We have some choral uh, music as well. But so you know, just a range. yeah, good it's, range. It's, it's just uh, a good range. Yeah, um, it's a song that when you put in your highly, highly guaranteed, put in your um, CD, you in your um, CD player, you not take it out because. Is going to bless you and bless Amen. your family. It's going to bring healing to you, um, and that is the whole point of the gospel. The gospel is to bring inspiration, to bring Amen. healing for people to get connected to God, exactly. and that is it. And um, I, this album, it's for every preacher of the gospel, every evangelist of the gospel, Amen. and the main aim is to help to push the gospel as far as it can. That's awesome, and that's what we need. We Amen. need that. Know we so speaking of the album and everything with the music, right. just let us know who are some of your musical, you know, inspirations or who inspires you musically. Well, I think it, it, it's a number of people. I listen to pretty much every gospel um, artist around there. I, um, but I'll say uh, in terms of mentorship, right. um, I was, I mean, I was fortunate enough to be mentored by now it's a bishop. His name is Bishop. Boku Bote Boku. Wow. He's uh, one of the finest bishops in the, at the Lighthouse uh, Church right now. He, uh, he took us under his arm and he, uh, his wings, sorry, like mm -hmm. to say. Mm -hmm. And um, he, he, really, he really mentored us, polished us, taught us the basics about ministry and uh, mm -hmm. singing gospel. Wow, that's yeah. awesome. Yeah. That's and uh, I'm, very, I'm, very, I'm very grateful. Yes.
very grateful that he did that so you can be here exactly. <laughs> where you are now. Exactly. Everything happens for a reason. So, where do you see yourself in the next five years? Musically, personally, everything. The next five years, where do you see yourself? Well, musically, I want to, uh, as much as possible, get all the songs that God has placed in me out, mm. you know, almost something out. I hope the songs doesn't stop coming, but I want to we get them out. So too. Yeah. <laughs> we need more. Amen. I will pray for more grace, yes. more anointing to yes. just, you know, be able to continue doing this work. It's yeah. something that I really like doing, mm -hmm. something that I love doing, and I'm fortunate enough to be, you know, be part of uh, God's calling and to be part of, you know, God's movement to sing the song Amen. and get people to know him more. That's right, that's right. And also, sorry to go back, where can we uh, purchase the album or where can we listen to the album and when will it be released? Um, the album will be released by September. September, okay, hopefully. great. Yeah. But for now, we just um, have the single out. Uh, it will be on YouTube very soon. Okay, I think great. right after this interview, <laughs> I could almost guarantee so that it's YouTube. Check YouTube. it out. Daniel Morrison will be check it out, yes. and uh, the music video will be there. Um, CD Baby, if you want to download it, it will also be on the iTunes as okay, well. Okay, great. So pretty much all the um, e music. E music. Will be on. Okay, yeah. great, great, great. And then my last question for you. Yes. Yeah. I know you're ready to like. <laughs> he's like, it's too hot. <laughs> um, so my last question for you is, what's an interesting or fun fact that we wouldn't know about you, or that we would be surprised to know about Daniel Morse? What's something fun fact. interesting? Yes. Wow. Well, I besides would say, the rapping. besides the rapping, <laughs> yeah. I would say I have, uh, I have traveled, uh, I would say close to 15 countries in the world. Wow. Uh, wow. Well, I mean, it was job related. Okay, but still, yeah. Yeah, and uh, I've seen a little bit of the world. It's 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 amazing. Wow. That's and awesome. um, I could speak a few um, foreign languages. I could speak Zulu. Zulu. I could speak. I could, I could speak a little bit of Kosa. Kosa. Okay, yeah. you have to. Say something. You have to. Unjani. Unjani. How are you doing? How are you doing? Yeah, that's, what I mean, so. <laughs> that's so cool. Wow. So, ladies and gentlemen, there you have it. This is Daniel Morrison. We are so glad to have had Thank you on the so show. Much. Thank you um, honestly, we're so excited, and may God continue to just bless everything that you're doing. We know Amen. it's going to be awesome. Amen. So, make sure you guys stay tuned and check it out on YouTube, iTunes. It's going to be out. Um, Thank you, Daniel. Thank this has been so great. <laughs> And that's it guys, stay tuned for our next show.